Hello Leo, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star. So Leo, this is your reading for the month of April 2021 and this is a general reading. So please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Also Leo, I would appreciate if you would uh, hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading, okay? Leo, uh, I would I would request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos, right? Let me explain you the format of this reading, Leo. I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent your energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards over here. They will represent the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with. In between, I'm going to place a couple of cards and they will represent the mutual energy between you and your person right thereafter i'm going to pull some cards from another deck and they will be the general messages they will be the non-love messages for you and your person later on we'll pull some oracle cards and they will be uh, the messages from the higher powers they will be the messages from the universe regarding this connection or in general right at the end we'll wind up this reading by pulling out one single card which will be the likely conclusion for the given situation okay all right leo let's get started so what is going on with leo So we have nine of cups for you, page of swords, four of uh, four of wands for your person. We have empress, the sun, the devil. Oh hey, and mutual energy is ten of cups, five of pentacles right so if i have to talk about the zodiac signs your person has all three major arcanas okay so the zodiac signs may be uh, libra leo capricorn uh, so pisces cancer scorpio gemini libra aquarius aries leo sag okay all right if the sign pops up all the better okay hmm so your energy is nine of cups page of swords and four of wands i feel like you are you're moving in the direction of your marriage okay or a long-term uh, long-term connection but still you are turning around and you are looking like where is my person is he coming back where is my person is he coming back okay is he or she coming back your person was a wish fulfillment for you leo your person was a wish fulfillment you are being forced you are tired you're very tired and you're moving ahead okay but still intermittently you stop okay you turn and you check okay you may go through the social media whatever like you know facebook instagram linkedin twitter and all that stuff wherever wherever this person have their wherever this person has their presence okay but let me tell you one thing you are definitely moving in the direction of long term commitment okay a long term commitment is coming your way okay just that don't turn around don't turn around you are you are dealing this process leo you're dealing this process you are still thinking about your past person a lot we'll check we'll check this uh, you know long-term commitment is with whom whether it is with a past person or whether it is with a new person okay but you are taking a pause and you're turning around the advice is do not turn around just keep walking just keep walking stop thinking about your past person you're dealing that okay once you withdraw your energy completely and if you really want this past person back withdraw your energy completely stop thinking about them think about yourself 
and then that person will feel jittery they will have jitters and they will be like oh leo has stopped thinking about me because they feel your energy leo they feel your energy i'm telling you until the time this person uh, is having this comfort of knowing like you know or uh, you know till the time they know that uh, your energy is there or till the time they feel your energy they will be in a comfortable spot once you withdraw that energy then they will become uncomfortable okay and then they will come towards you okay so this is what i'm trying to advise you if you want your person back if you are past person back okay i see that marriage and commitment is coming towards you whosoever wants marriage whosoever wants commitment that is coming towards you as far as your person empress sun and the devil ooh this person thinks that you are this the empress the empress the someone who is extremely abundant someone who is who has everything okay she is she or he okay that person is content and satisfied with whatever they have and they don't need anyone else and uh, they think that you are doing good materialistically you have your own happiness you you are capable of finding happiness whether in yourself whether outside and uh, no they they think that ne they have never seen a person who was so happy so content with oneself okay because they are not they are not happy they are not content with themselves they think that there are a lot of uh, they lack a lot within themselves okay they think that they have lot of weaknesses they think that they need to overcome lot of weaknesses and they think that you will help them overcome okay so they are a kind of codependent on you okay leo this person is codependent on you this person is codependent uh, on you for a lot of things okay emotionally this person is codependent they want you to help them to come out of their insecurities they want you to help them to come out of their addictions if at all there are any they want to go back to the roots this person wants to go back to the roots this person have never experienced happiness in their life okay true happiness till the time you entered in their life and now this person is experiencing so much of happiness and they don't want to let go of that happiness okay and that can happen only if they are able to stop you right this person is highly obsessed about you okay very very highly obsessed about you i feel that they get angry i mean the kind of an energy i'm getting over here is that they get angry if someone starts talking to you they cannot handle the fact that someone forget about being interested in you okay even if someone starts talking to you someone starts talking to you okay they cannot handle that as well this person is like insanely obsessive about you obsessive and possessive about you uh you may have told this person couple of times like this is what is unacceptable and finally you walked away because of that as well okay mutual energy is that of 10 of cups and five of pentacles yeah so there is both of you are aware that there is something that is holding both of you back from this 10 of cups from this happiness which both of you are capable to achieve because it's it is in mutual energy right so both of you are capable to achieve this 10 of cups but then there is something that is holding someone back okay and someone needs to walk away from whatever they are being from what from whatever they are being hold whatever is holding them back right they need to walk away from that otherwise they won't be able to experience both of you won't be able to experience this ten of cups i feel that for some of you your past person is coming back for some of you with that sun card i feel that a new person is coming towards you someone who is quite young at heart but someone who is going to be very truthful someone who is going to be very honest someone who will love you and take care of you a lot okay so i am getting a mixed energy over here energy of a past person as well energy of a new person as well okay but one thing is for sure you are headed towards a long term commitment leo so let's see what are the general messages 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 for leo and their person what are the general messages for leo and their person
queen of swords three of swords seven of wands mutual energy sorry not mutual energy your personal energy is death and rebirth yeah page of wands empress again wow this person wants to make you pregnant okay this person wants to make you pregnant this person wants you to be their baby mama they they are they in they are ready to do whatever it takes okay that's that's a clear message they are ready to transform it's not going to happen easily let me tell you that it will be a process which they will commence and then it will get stopped in between again you'll have to push them again they will start it again it will may face certain hurdles okay till the time they get transformed it's a very long process let me tell you that if you are willing to get back to this person you will have to have a lot of patience but the fruits are very good you will experience that 10 of cups when once uh, things get streamlined between both of you i just saw 11 11 so you may be twin flames there is a runner and a chaser uh, relationship over here so this person is ready to transform you uh, transform for you and they don't want to they don't uh, they are not ready to give up on you let me tell you that even if you reject them countless times this person is going to stand outside your door and they will be like no you have to accept me you are going to reject them let me tell you that you are going to reject them multiple times not just one time but you're going to reject them multiple times but still they are going to be very much insistent and they are still they are going to be very much determined and then finally you only out of sympathy you're going to accept them back <laughs> you are this you are this queen of swords like no i'm not going to accept any kind of shit you have broken my heart multiple times and i'm not going to allow that uh, to happen again i'm protecting myself and all that stuff okay but once they stand outside your door you will forget everything but don't worry this person is not coming this time around to deceive you at least that's the kind of an energy i'm getting especially with the death card they are ready to transform themselves they are ready to work towards this connection that's a big message of this uh, okay uh you are focusing on your self love uh, leo you're focusing you're trying to pamper yourself you are like no let me take care of myself you are doing some yoga meditation you are grooming yourself gro going for a massage going to a parlor grooming your hair and uh, you know going for a facial or something like that you are taking care of yourself you're like i'm a, i i am a queen i'm an empress okay i need to take care of myself you've gone through a lot but you are hiding whatever has happened uh with you okay let it flow let it flow leo let it flow okay emotions don't keep your emotions pent up you know what happens a simple example of a pressure cooker the steam gets built up in that pressure cooker and then what happens once the cooker is filled up with that steam okay then that whistle blows right you don't want to reach till that stage you always allow your emotions to flow you, if you want to cry cry if you if you are shy crying in front of anyone else go lock yourself in a bedroom and cry but do help yourself uh, help help to heal yourself okay help yourself right all right so let's see what are the messages from the universe what are the messages from the universe what are the messages from the universe envy yin and yang yes 11 11 death rebirth empress twice 10 of cups four of wands you people are meant to be together okay either this past person you're gonna get married to that or either the next person it will be you're gonna seal the deal you're gonna seal the deal i'm telling you okay if it is next person fine but there afterwards i don't see you getting into a relationship at least it will be a long-term relationship and you some of you are getting married uh, some of you are getting married 
uh, Ten of Cups, Four of Wands, you know, Empress twice, Sun, which also signifies happiness. Pregnancy is what is big time, I can see. We have Empress twice, we have Sun card, okay? So pregnancy is something that's going to happen for quite some of you. Yeah, and even the yin and the yang, if you observe this closely, okay, this figure, it looks like a fetus. Anyone, I believe that you people will understand what I'm trying to say, okay? This looks like a fetus, this figure, the yin and the yang, right? So I definitely sense that there is going to be a pregnancy. Someone is jealous of you, someone is jealous of your person, someone is jealous of this connection. Be careful. From negative people let's see what are the messages from the universe higher powers what are the messages what are the messages regarding this connection or in general right you know what to do you're confused but the answer is within you only you know what to do love is never in vain don't ever think that love is in vain you know love is the most beautiful feeling in this world okay and see you know what uh there are these tides in the life right you experience happiness then you have to experience downfall to experience happiness all over again and why you have to experience that downfall or a low phase is because so that you'll understand the importance of happiness okay the main purpose is to understand the importance of happiness if you don't understand that what is the use if a person is continuously happy if a person is not going to if a person is not going through any kind of a downfall in their life this person will never understand the importance of happiness how valuable happiness is right everyone is doing their best do not doubt anyone's capabilities you will be surprised a uh, surprise is coming your way you're born with that it quality dwell on what you love do not think of what you don't want always think positive okay because you are sending those messages to the universe this is what i want okay if you keep on thinking something it will come towards you if you're thinking negative, it will come towards you. If you're thinking positive, it will come towards you. So you know, right, whatever you're thinking has a power to convert that into reality. You have that power to convert your, convert your thoughts into reality. So stop thinking negative. Think positive. Love doesn't have to mean near. Someone is missing you. Right, so let's see uh, what is the likely conclusion for the given situation. What is the likely conclusion for the given situation? What is the likely conclusion for the given situation? What is the likely conclusion for the given situation? What is the likely conclusion for the given situation? What is the likely conclusion for the given situation? Eight of Wands. Ooh, the much awaited communication is coming towards you. Okay, much awaited communication, the heart to heart conversation, back to back communication, some messages on WhatsApp or some messages on Messenger, messages, SMS, you know, a mail or uh, you know, video calling, calling. It's going to happen big time. Okay, there will be a lot of communication and a lot of fiery communication is going to happen. Both of you are going to feel extremely passionate about one another again. Okay, someone is missing you big time, Leo. Someone is missing you and this person wants you back. They are going to open up their heart, I'm telling you. They are going to open up their heart in front of you. They, they will be like, These, this is what I feel. This is what, I, you know, every single feeling I have for you. This is being placed in front of you on the table. The ball is in your court. Decide now. Just don't say no. <laughs> this person is desperate. Let me tell you that. This person is not going to accept rejection right away. You will really, really, if at all you want to reject them, 
you'll have to convey them umpteen times like I don't want it I don't want you I don't want you I don't want this connection okay all right I hope this resonates please hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye